Welcome everybody, I'm the Urban Watcher and this is a tutorial for how to set up MooBot. This tutorial is part of a um, how to become a streamer series where we cover all the basic um, uh, technologies and programs that you might need if you're interested in becoming a streamer either on Twitch TV or if you're interested in using this uh, Twitch to be able to post on YouTube. Uh, in this tutorial we will be talking about Nightbot. Uh, and what is Nightbot, how to use the commands and I, and, and, uh, for Nightbot, and we're going to explore some of the features. Um, I, in my streams, I actually use two different bots. I use the uh, Nightbot and I use the Moobot. And the reason these are important is uh, because they're, they're really automated tools that you could use to control spam. Uh, to enforce any type of anti-spam or to help you do things like give, do giveaways. Um, a lot of people use them for polls or to advertise websites or information while they're doing something else like playing a game or having some type of discussion. So, in uh, how to set up Nightbot, let's go ahead and get started. Now, first of all, uh, there are a couple ways to find a Nightbot. One of the first and most common is to just be able to type in Nightbot into the, uh, the search and you're going to get some search results and the very top one is going to be the actual Nightbot uh, web page. If we were to go there, this is the Twitch uh, portal to the website and um, if you don't want to go through all that, I mean from here it will take you to the command list or you can actually go to the Nightbot website. If you want to go to the Nightbot website by itself, just go to nightbot.tv okay? And it's going to take you to this home page. Now, this home page is it breaks down all their different features. Um, it's this, like we said, Nightbot is a wonderful uh, tool that you can use to protect you against spam or anyone, any any type of uh, griefer uh, that you might encounter while you're doing your stream. Now, it's not so important when you're when you're starting out and you're getting just your first few, but it's actually not a bad idea if you're one of those people that uh, you you have you just started and you're wondering if you want to do this you might want to add uh, Nightbot and uh, Moobot into your stream because you know when other people check out your channel at least from the search window you at least have two other people in there and they uh, they're they're more likely to jump into a populated room than be, being the first and only ones in your stream so I mean that's just a little pro tip for, for, for folks that are just kind of starting off so on this Nightbot TV, you see that it gives you uh, spam protection. You can customize it. Uh, Nightbot has its own set of commands that I, I personally think are a little bit easier. They're similar to the Moobots. Uh, you can put timers, assign your, your, your folks that are regulars so that they're maybe excluded from a lot of the anti-spam like caps or, or giving them the, op the opportunity to be able to post links. Uh, your subscribers. It does a really excellent job in helping you manage a subscriber base if you get to that part. If you get to that point where you get really, really successful, uh, I think Night Nightbot is probably the easiest out of the uh, subscriber uh, management tools that you could use. Um, also, it's it was uh, when it was set up, it has a setup for playing music. So if you're one of those folks that is playing a game and you want to give control to your user or your adopted admin, whoever's uh, working as a moderator on your account, you, they can actually uh, control uh, music that's being played in the background. It gives giveaway and uh, of course uh, you can do like instant winners which is really what I use in mine. So the commands are pretty simple. If you go to from this page if you were to click Nightbot commands it would take you to this page and you were to have everything you could possibly want how to set it up. Now it's pretty simple. The first thing that you're going to want to do is have Nightbot join. So let me show you on my page. Now Nightbot is already a, uh, a follower, a joiner, and an admin on my page. So even if I tell him come to my page, he uh, he's not going to respond immediately. So Nightbot join. Now uh, Depending on your internet connection, like he usually doesn't respond because he's already in the sh in the page. You can confirm that by your viewer list. Uh, if you want Nightbot, every time you you don't want to have to pit Nightbot join every single time you load up your page. You're going to want to type in the next command, which is Nightbot follow, 
and mine is going to give you a little bit of back talk. It's going to tell me, oh, I can't follow you. My uh, follow is full. My follow list is full. Part of the reason is I'm already on its follow list. Now, um, once it, it's actually in your page, there's there's actually a command that you could give it admin rights, but it's actually just kind of easier to type to uh, click on its name. And this bottom, the top right corner has an, uh, a little a little lightning bolt that says OP. Uh, it basically gives it admin's rights to be able to moderate your channel. Uh, mine already has the admin rights, so if I were to click DOP, it would take it away. So I don't really want to do that, but that is one of the easiest ways to give it moderation power. But just because you've, get it moder you, you've allowed it to join, you've made it follow you, and you've given it OP powers doesn't mean that it's automatically set up. You still have to go and customize the level of protection that you want. You know, if you want it to be able to disable uh, web links or cap capital letters, um, what type of uh, does, are you even going to mess with the the music part of it? Uh, this is the list that you're going to have to come in and do it. Uh, allow the users see this is where. Uh, uh, capital caps time on so this protects you against caps and you would have to do that in the actual window here to be able to be effective okay so like I said uh, Nightbot is perfect for uh, being able to protect you against spam now that's service level okay great you did that you're protected against spam now what well if you're trying to build your channel it could also be a, a very cool tool because you can uh, you can do things like giveaways or, or launch messages I usually keep my uh, list of, of what it can do on a, on a piece of paper on my desk and so here are some of the things you can do you can actually change the title of your stream on the fly without having to log in um, from the window uh, from the chat uh, if you want you can do instant winners which is one of my favorites so let's say I have uh, uh, plenty of people and I'm gonna give away a game you can do capital um, exclamation point type the word winner and it picks somebody at random from your channel and since I'm the only one in here when I'm doing this it picks me and sometimes I'll just like to spam myself and see that my name is in the winner section so I, you know that's just me uh, you can also change static messages so let's say that I wanted a message to appear every time somebody comes in so I would click static and I would type something like um, uh, welcome to the feed uh, there you go and uh, Movebot will probably actually do this as well but Nightbot takes it and you puts that into its uh, its feed message whenever you load into my channel it's gonna automatically welcome you and it's gonna any message that I have in here I could have easily said visit visit www.youtube the zombie professor uh, click follow or subscribe or whatever any message you wanted to repeat when when people are seeing that you're gonna wanna put it in there uh, you also have this thing called topics so if I wanted to change the topic for the day, so let's say today's topic was um, how to be a streamer, Movebot and Nightbot will take that and change it. So there's there's Movebot and then another Nightbot. He changed it to uh, how to be a streamer. And if I click topic, oh, it should, there it is. It, look at the Nightbot line. It shows the topic, and then it shows my embedded uh, static message right after that. And that's that's exactly what you wanted to do. Uh, so not always are we actually displaying something uh, amazing. We, so some of us actually work in the chat to do giveaways and to and to uh, micromanage kind of our population and community. So this is really good for that. Now giveaways, um, you know, you could do instant polls. You can do if we look at the command here. Let me scroll down a little bit. Uh, topics, messages, uh, joining, removing. Uh, there is one command. Let's see. Do, do the winner bar. Oh, we did the winner. Okay. So it's it's capital. So let me review that. It's exclamation point winner. And that is the one of the easiest ways. I've seen people use the raffles or the pick a number thing. And that's really contingent on everybody in your in your chat. Uh, 
waking up and being responsive. So, you know, what happens when if you have 50 people in your room and it, the the bot tells them pick a number between one and 100 and only like three people pick a number? Uh, well, you know, the, the people that, that aren't paying attention or they're, that are there for whatever reason during a, a raffle, it could be, you know, it, they, could, they could be easily excluded. Using the uh, winner function will pick somebody at random with, uh, and, and include anybody that's in the channel. And it will also give you information whether that person is following your channel. If they are following your channel, I know that a lot of Twitch, uh, Twitch uh, streamers will only give out prizes to people that follow them. So, I mean, this will give you additional information than just somebody pressing one, two, or three. Really kind of make your audience uh, uh, contribute or do something for whatever giveaway you have. So, again, I'm The Urban Watcher, and my YouTube channel, where you can find most of my uh, videos, are, um, are on the, the YouTube channel Zombie Professor. And this is part of a, a larger series on how to be a streamer. If you like this uh, type of video, please leave a comment, follow, subscribe, thumbs up, all that mess. And uh, I appreciate you. If you have any comments, leave it below. Thank you very much. I'm the Urban Watcher.